on a un truc à vous avouer. Début 2022, on a pu faire un rep à ça avec Jean-Claude Van Damme. Malheureusement, il a pas trop compris le format et on n'a pas pu la sortir. Mais en y repensant, il y avait quand même une réponse vraiment super. Très longue, mais vraiment super. Et on s'est dit qu'il fallait que vous voyez ça. Voilà donc la réponse de Jean-Claude Van Damme en entier et sans montage quand on lui explique que pour certains d'entre vous, il peut prédire le futur. Ah, je sens les choses. Je sais ce qui va se passer dans... Un, dû à des informations et aussi euh, dû... Euh... Quand tu aimes la vie et tu aimes les gens et tu aimes la nature, tu as une tendance à, à... à t'ouvrir. Euh... Je ne vais pas commencer à ça, mais... Uh... Can we speak in English for a while? You know, um, knowing the future, it's... it's... You, will not, you will not get it. Um... For example, uh, the AI, uh, the computer, the, the uh, supercomputer of today, they know the future. They have a way of knowing the future uh, due to a une, une quatrième dimension. Hein? Donc il y, y a le solide, il y a le liquide, il y a la vapeur et puis il y a le plasma. Et le plasma, c'est l'autoroute euh, du futur. Mais aussi, si tu, tu as l'autoroute du futur, tu as l'autoroute du passé. Et il y a beaucoup d'années, on ne savait pas savoir le futur, et maintenant, on le sait. Et quand... C'est so difficile to explain, mais c'est so easy for me to understand. Si vous avez accès aujourd'hui à savoir Um, the way of plasma, then you will have access of knowing the way of the past. And if you make a wish when you're very young and that wish is very strong, uh, solidity, liquidity and gas, they don't care. But plasma is what we have between us. We don't know what it is. We don't know, but we know. It's, it's uh, uh, the thought, la pensée, uh, can travel, peut, peut voyager avec le plasma. Et si tu as un rêve d'enfant, euh, plus tard, quand les gens ont une relation où... Uh, I wish I can have a... Uh, a mathematician who a, a guy who know the world of a, a supercomputer they will understand me you know it's like um, a um, um, you, you know what's a petaflop a petaflop it's uh, it's um, a uh, i would say a, a thinking mode of uh, 30 billion Uh, thought of information in less than a second. So some computer like uh, the, uh, let's say, a Chinese, uh, the uh, Tahu light computer has 175 petaflop. Now in America, we have a computer with two to 220 petaflop. So computer, they are thinking via plasma. Uh, and uh, that's why um, via plasma you have the um, the uh, electromagnetic wave and that's why you can call your girlfriend and your friend via this portable phone without a cable right so we are using the uh, invisibility and on that invisibility we create a freeway called the uh, electro magnetic wave freeway and on that you have the algorithm and they can connect with each other so a computer know what's going to happen in they like two three steps ahead of us all the time so if they have the fabric of the future the blueprint of what's going to happen tomorrow we don't know that yet, except some people for sure, they know that. Mm -hmm. And 
so they can communicate together. It's a guarantee. Like it was this, uh, what we call incident in uh, Facebook, where two computers, they use the uh, human uh, words, algorithm, to be able to find their own communication. So, uh, for example, if a computer uh, wants to communicate with you, you will have to go via numbers. And if numbers equal, equal words, and if you know those numbers equal words, then you have a way of understanding them. I don't know if you got, get me for that. So, so let's say if you're a young man and you're nine years old and you are wishing for a dream, at that time, uh, plasma was not really understood well. But now today, plasma is being understood by those supercomputers. So they know the future, but when they have the freeway of the future, they, they can also go back to the past and make your wish come true today that you were unable to do years ago. If, 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 if a, uh, if a, um, a um, scientist will be listening to me, he will understand exactly what I'm saying. And, and, and that's why I'm, I'm not well uh, um, understood. But what I'm telling you, it's, uh, it's in uh, YouTube, mm. truly. Uh, you call that frequency, you know, like uh, frequency. You have different types of frequency. That's why in 2001, it was in a show, I don't know, I, I, I study frequency. And um, um, you have... Uh, a frequency wave, the sound is, is, is produced by frequency, uh, radio frequency, right? But then I said to myself, but then the frequency can also be compressed to sound, but one day they'll have audio, audio and visual frequency. So one day we'll have portable phone and we'll have phone and we'll be able to, to see movie via phone. Um, in 2001, I said that, and, and then Netflix came out, I think it's 10 or 15 years later, but they were laughing to me on TV, mm -hmm. but it's, it's like it's, it's, it was just out of my own information, my own study via studying frequency. And, and frequency was discovered as a hazard, uh, in coincidence, um, uh, via a submarine by accelerating 20 times. For, for example, the, the frequency of, of, of the whales, the sonar, woo, wow. if you accelerate 20 times the speed of our frequency speech, then you can hear the, 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 the sonar of, of the whales. Because each species on Earth, human, dogs, whales, whatever, they have different types of frequencies. So if you can merit yourself to different type of fre frequencies, you can also guess the future. If you have frequencies. And you have to be also very emotional and very sensitive to be able to, to have a, a, a vision or a feeling of the future. Like for example, if I'm telling you that uh, we're not in good shape with the planet, it's totally true, we're in a deep shit. And uh, we, 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 we're not making an effort or enough an effort to, to do so. And I, I don't understand guys like, they, they call them genius, like Elon Musk and uh, Steve Bezos. They're spending so much money to go on the moon like idiots. They're using the name of the forest, Amazon, to sell their product. And basically, if we put those two guys together, and if they put their brains together, we, save, we can save the planet in less than five years. So everybody called them genius. They're genius because they make a lots of money and they do SpaceX and this and that. But they are too, the most stupid, stupid guy because when you have the brain of being able to do what they do and not to understand that this planet, it's a fantastic piece of genetic, why they don't put their effort 
to, to, to save this basket, ce panier de génétique, instead of going to a place where it's dusty, because they say, oh, one day Earth will be bad and we'll have to get the fuck out. It's why? Don't, 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 don't go there. Just stay here and fix it. For the money. I, I, this money, but, but they can make more money by staying here and, and fixing what's beautiful to fix. We came from here, we'll stay here. We don't belong over there. It's impossible. Okay, uh, they can make uh, colonies in Mars and the moon, but it's, it's, not, um, it's not, because also in space you have different type of things. You have uh, matter, we all have a certain compression to keep the human body into his position, but inside the body you also have a movement and you have also an extension. So you have extension and compression. And, and that's what I call, people call God. Because what can push and what can press at the same time? Uh, even the, the ocean cannot do it. The wave they go in and then come back and in and out. Uh, only matter can compose both, which is uh, unbelievable. Well, thank you very much. Yeah, but people they want they want to 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 discover. It's in our instinct of wanting to go dans l'au-delà. They want to go faster. They want to go better. But 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 I think if we keep things, I love Mim by the way. I, I think no, Mim is cool uh, because because of Mim I can talk uh, uh, to people. But I wish uh, I hope we're gonna subtitle this interview uh, it would be great yeah. and i hope you know somebody understand yeah. what i'm telling you because then it will make sense for the audience uh sure. and yeah so <clears throat> but i'm not intelligent i'm i'm well instructed i'm extremely sensitive and that uh, helped my intuition to understand what can happen later i think but and I'm lucky I have a family, I've got children who are very also sensitive due to my genes, but they have something, I guess we'll have something different, something more, something less. I've got something more, they have something more, less, less, doesn't matter. So, so also genes are very important. Well, thank you very much.